one experience where uh, somebody said, oh, I'll show you around. It was a taxi driver. He said, oh, I'll show you around the city. And I asked beforehand just to make sure because I didn't have much cash with me that day. <laughs> so I asked them. Um, and, then, and then at first he gave me one price, but then at the end he gave me like double that price. Are you afraid of getting rid of? Uh, a little bit at the start when I first get here, um, but once I get comfortable and know that it's a safe place, then I'm okay. Yeah. Not too much. I'm not too afraid of being ripped off when traveling to foreign countries, but I try to find information that might be helpful to avoid situations like that. Maybe like a certain like area that that maybe is common, uh, that happens commonly. Um, in certain locations, maybe I'll avoid going there, but um, I'm not too afraid of it. You're wary. You're uh, you're always looking out for it, but it's um, it's part of, it's part of the journey. You have to you, have, you get everyone gets ripped off. Everyone gets ripped off. Okay, so when traveling uh, into Vietnam, have you gotten ripped off before? I think so, but it's difficult for us to when we're first here with the money. The money is very different to the way we work in London or in America or anything. So. Yeah, uh, probably, okay. but not that bad, not that bad. I've had one experience where uh, somebody said, oh, I'll show you around, it was a taxi driver, he said, oh, I'll show you around the city, and I asked beforehand just to make sure because I didn't have much cash with me that day. <laughs> so I asked them, um, and, then, and then at first he gave me one price, but then at the end he gave me like double that price, but I didn't have the money with me. So that was a little bit, but that was a little bit of a difficult experience for me. But it was all I had, so I just gave him the original price and it was okay. There's been times where somebody wants me to buy something that maybe I didn't go to the store, but they want me to buy. Uh, situations like that have happened, but I don't think I've personally been, feel like I've been ripped off. Have you have ever heard of any warnings before? Yeah, um, back home we have websites and certain information that we look at before traveling. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of warnings. Lot of like, warnings. Uh, if so, what service do you often hear hearing about? Um, motorcycles, um, damage to motorcycles and stuff like that. When you rent your motorcycle out, people will be charged for damages that were, that were there before, that type of thing. No, I haven't. Maybe not. Yeah. Before traveling to a certain country, do you research the price of the place before? No. no? Not really. So before going to places, I do like to look at websites or see things very briefly. I don't research a lot, but I do like to look at maybe the typical pricing or um, what the exchange rate is, etc. just to be aware. And even in Vietnam, we've been really blessed to have really great friends that are always with us, making sure we're okay and that we're not getting ripped off. So, um, so I feel like with Vietnam, we've been okay. Always at... Um resort prices um, understand that you have to negotiate or barter um, but then um, obviously making sure you have the best price um, and not getting ripped off yes a bit bit worried because um, understanding how much it is for us in our currency versus how much Vietnamese dong is a bit tricky so yeah at the start um, when you come here maybe paying too much and also when a bit tired as well um, it makes um, sometimes it's 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 different for us because it's a bit harder to to negotiate yeah and we if you encounter a situation like being ripped off does yeah. that affect your feelings for the place or affect your travel experience a little bit for me um, but like i mentioned it's been really great to have friends uh, mm -hmm. local friends that are there to help us uh, and to make sure that you know we don't have those experiences, but it is a little bit hurtful. I feel really sad uh, going to other countries, um, and if I'm being ripped, uh, if I have an experience like that, um, it can be hurtful in the moment. But I also understand that's not everybody. Obviously, uh, right. every country has like very amazing, strong things, and um, there's also for each country things that maybe can be difficult for other people, and so. 
um, I try not to be too affected by it because I know that there's many, many wonderful people in that country as well. It's the same thing everywhere. If people go to England, they get ripped off as well. Oh. So it's, uh, it's very similar everywhere, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's fine with you, right? Yeah, I'm fine with it. Okay. With it. It's not that bad. Whenever you're traveling, because you're going to a different country, difficult things may happen and that's okay because you're visiting a new country. But at the same time, we're all human and so I think the most important thing is we all respect each other no matter where we're coming from or what our background is. Respect is the most important thing.